In this video, we'll take some online animations that I downloaded from Mixamo and start incorporating them into the timeline to jazz things up a little bit. Okay, so once we've recorded our animation, what we can start doing is adding additional animation to it. Now, this could be anything. It could be FBX files from anywhere, ones that you've created or maybe something you've downloaded. These ones I grabbed from the Mixamo site. I encourage you to check it out if it's still around. And we can start mixing it all together. Uh, let's take some animation that we recorded. So scene, scene track animation from this character, and we'll stick it on here. There we go. And now let's take the animation here, and let's give her a, let's take a stop and sit or something. So we have a stand to sit animation. Let's just pull and pop it in here, see what happens. So she should go back to zero. But I think if we do this, we go match offsets to previous clip. There she goes. So she runs, and then she sits. Great. So we could start combining different animation together. And then let's have her sit idle for a while. Pull this in. Right click this, match offsets to previous. Now this one she drops in a little bit weird. So maybe we need to offset her position a little bit more. We can change it here. There we go. Okay, she does that. And let's get her to get up. So I think we have an animation I downloaded called, um, there it is, sit to stand. Let's pull this animation in. There we go. Bump. Okay, and we'll just say match offsets. There she goes. And then we could just pull this one in, get her to start walking. And we'll say again, match offsets. Now this, we need to change our Y offset here. Zero. There we go. Now, where there's glitches and problems in it, but this is stuff that we can easily fix in Maya. So we can blend these two together just a little bit. I don't know all the hotkeys yet, but there we go. And off she goes. Cool. So now we've, instead of just taking what we had, we've assembled an additional animation. So we can play that back. Not the most interesting screen to look at them so far away. I might blend these two together. So let's select all these guys. Slide over a bit. Okay, great. So let's retrack her animation. So we have her go. Great. It's pretty good. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's not, it's not great, of course. So let's just export this animation. We'll call this Gear, Dear Girl Take 3. And in the next video, we'll take a look at pulling this all into Maya and binding it to our HIK rig.